pardon me if I stutter a lot. I'm really nervous. <laughs> okay. The hypnotic pull of this drug takes me under, intoxi intoxicating, distorting my every thought, trying to take away the pain of my heart breaking, but it is only intensified. Takes the broken shards and liquefies the pieces. The sorrow is now pure pain, rhythmically pumping through my veins. With the beat of my heart, I feel it grow stronger, constricting, imprisoning my mind, throat, and body feeling like I'm floating under the water, the water of reality. Plunging down into the darkness further, the cold seeps into my pores. I am pulled into a abyss. But what is this? There is a beat and a rhythm. The lyrics saving me move my whole world. Emptiness clearing, I am no longer blurred. The music is my solace helps me from escaping, sparks the inspiration I am constantly chasing, grabs me from the depth of my lonely and solitude, and saves me from my own thoughts and shadows I have fallen through. <laughs> Frustration and irritation take over. Time is paused, I feel my body collapse. I feel the icy cold blanket of judgment enveloping my soul into its dark separation from inspiration. I want it to stop. It takes over. My thoughts I can't control. My words I cannot say, but they don't need to know, I guess. I want to run away. I need something to help, help me fade away. All right, this one has a quote from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. <sighs> Insanity, 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 insanity. In ignore the incoherent whispers of my insanity. It runs through me like speeding streams of fire, pulsating, the constant beat, never slowing, never stopping. There's no earthly way of knowing exactly which direction we are rowing, or which way the river's flowing. Is it raining? Is it snowing? Is a hurricane, is a hurricane a blowing? Not a speck of light is showing, so the danger must be growing. For the fires of hell are glowing, still the rowers keep on rowing, and they're certainly not showing any signs that they are slowing. There is no light, only darkness, in which we see nothing but the images in our heads. I feel the emptiness and solitude invading. There is no such thing as life, it is only imagination of ourselves. We can choose to ignore. It must be fake, a dream of my making. Yet the burning sensation to which pain inflicts still offers the sick possibility that this is all real, gathered together in a big fucked up setting. <laughs>